let image of point 8 comma 5 comma 7 with respect to, to the line x minus 1 upon 2 is equal to y plus 1 upon 3 is equal to z minus 2 upon 5 is given alpha beta gamma then sum alpha plus beta plus gamma is equal to so let us consider the foot of the perpendicular say m and to consider the general point on the given line say x minus 1 upon 2 is equal to y plus 1 upon 3 is equal to z minus 2 upon 5 is equal to lambda so that x minus 1 upon 2 is equal to lambda y plus 1 upon 3 is equal to lambda and z minus 2 upon 5 is equal to lambda so x is equal to 2 lambda plus 1 y is equal to 3 lambda minus 1 and z is equal to 5 lambda plus 2 so let us consider the point general point on the line m point we can write 2 lambda plus 1 comma 3 lambda minus 1 comma 5 lambda plus 2 so here is the point m and now direction ratios of direction ratios of given line can be taken as 2 3 and 5 so we can write 2 comma 3 comma 5 and direction ratios of direction ratios of line joining p and m can be taken as since we know that when two points are given x1 y1 z1 and x2 y2 z2 direction ratios can be taken x2 minus x1 y2 minus y1 z2 minus z1 so here we can use m point and the point p so we can write 2 lambda plus 1 minus 8 3 lambda minus 1 minus 5 and 5 lambda plus 2 minus 7 that is 2 lambda minus 7 comma 3 lambda minus 6 comma 5 lambda minus 5 so these are the direction ratios of pm and also we know that pm is perpendicular to the given line so we can use the condition a1 a2 plus b1 b2 plus c1 c2 is equal to 0 where a1 b1 c1 are the direction ratios of one line and b a2 b2 c2 are the direction ratios of its perpendicular line so we get two times of 2 lambda minus 7 plus three times of 3 lambda minus 6 plus five times of 5 lambda minus 5 which is equal to 0 so we can write 4 lambda minus 14 plus 9 lambda minus 18 plus 25 lambda minus 25 is equal to 0 so we can write 4 plus 9 13 13 plus 25 is 38 and again minus 14 minus 18 is minus 32 minus 25 which is minus 57 is equal to 0 so we can write lambda is equal to 57 upon 38 or we can write 19 3 times and 19 2 times so the value of lambda is 3 upon 2 so if we get the lambda value so we can say the point m is where the point m is given 2 lambda plus 1 comma 3 lambda minus 1 and 5 lambda plus 2 so substituting we get 3 lambda that is 2 times of lambda 2 into 3 by 2 
plus 1 comma 3 into 3 by 2 minus 1 comma 5 into 3 by 2 plus 2 so we can say 3 plus 1 4 and here it is 9 minus 2 that is 7 upon 2 and here it is 15 plus 4 that is 19 upon 2 so this is the point m and since q is the image of the point alpha beta gamma and m is the midpoint m is the midpoint so we can use the concept here 8 plus alpha upon 2 is equal to the x coordinate of m and phi plus beta upon 2 is equal to the y coordinate and here we can write 7 plus gamma upon 2 is equal to 19 upon 2 so we can write 8 plus alpha is equal to 8 alpha is equal to 0 and here we can write 5 plus beta is equal to 7 so beta is equal to 2 and 7 plus gamma is equal to 19 so gamma is equal to 12 so therefore the point alpha beta gamma the image we can get 0 comma 2 comma 12 so therefore the sum alpha plus beta plus gamma is equal to 0 plus 2 plus 12 which is equal to 14 so 14 is the answer which is option d